I'm going to fit a safety cutoff switch to this boat um, so that I can cut the power without opening the lid if I want to. Um, it's more for, well for me, it's more for taping the thing up before I even get in the car and uh, when I get to the lake I don't have to muck around taping it up, I can just plug the um, plug it in and go. So I was thinking of trying it with some of these EC5 plugs today. Um, I'm thinking we put, uh, put it in the back here like this and then you just have to wire it into here, into the positive or negative on the battery, it doesn't matter. Um, and we just want to break the circuit. five and a half mil terminals on the speed controller uh, in all my boats actually so we're going with five and a half mil doesn't matter which side you're going to put these on it's going to be a male and a female That's my plug made, so it's going to be sitting in there like that. <coughs> one side to the battery, and one side to the speed controller. I've made my switch now. So now I've just got to glue this part in. Uh, you could use epoxy. I'm just going to use my hot melt glue gun because I'm lazy. Just glue on either side of it. Make sure it can't go forward or back. So it's a really cheap and simple way. <coughs> to make a safety switch uh, so it doesn't matter if you do it on the negative side or the positive side you just got to have one each different here obviously let's go into the speed controller this one's going to the battery now I can tape my lid up before I even go anywhere and when I get to the lake plug it in and fire up and then while well, the lid's still taped up, just, you just pull it off and everything's safe now. <laughs> 